One of the main status goals of the ultra-rich is owning airplanes. The average Joe may say something along the lines of, well, they worked hard to get that plane. Which all I gotta say is, did a rich guy tell you that? Airplanes and celebrities. Two giant pains in the ass for everyone on this planet, but for some reason we still have them around. These two share the common denominator of being bad for the old planet Earth. Private jets are one of the worst contributors to the climate crisis as they spit out 3,376 metric tons of CO2. To put that into perspective, that is 480 times more than the average American's annual emissions. The biggest offender of this Taylor Shake It Off Swift, who leads the pack at a whopping 8,293 metric tons, emitted as she flew 170 flights in a year. The issue is that even when used for a little jaunt, these planes are burning so much fuel because they are 20 ton machines that laugh in the face of God. Peter DiCarlo, Associate Professor of Environmental Health and Engineering at John Hopkins University, who specializes in atmospheric air pollution, has this to say. The act of taking a huge piece of metal and putting it up in the sky is going to be an enormous carbon footprint that's really not necessary, especially for short distances. Now some celebrities, such as the Taylor Swift camp, dispute this, saying Taylor's jet is loaned out regularly to other individuals, which, I'm gonna be honest, doesn't make it any better. Look, nothing I own that I can loan out would ever cause that amount of environmental damage. While we can always do our part in reducing emissions, we also have to remember that celebrities live in a whole different world than us and are completely detached from reality. Now this doesn't mean they are exempt from law. <laughs> Just kidding, they totally are because money solves all problems and the only way to change this is through the fun subject of closing tax loopholes and by the banning of personal planes, which we will have to get to on another time. So until then, remember that rich people aren't better than you and they ain't smarter than you. They just have money. And they are, in fact, a bunch of dipshits. Undeniable.